The Deck Network. Build a deck. Bam! This is The Deck Network. I'm your host, Mike Danzilio, and we have the loose cannon right here. The co-host, Matt Dalton, and remember here at The Deck Network, it's all decks all the time, and today uh, we're talking about railing, Mike? Yes, nice job. Yeah, today Thank we're going to talk much. about, this, this I think is the first of this show that we've ever done on The Deck Network, and it's on aluminum railings. Okay. Aluminum railings have become very popular the last few years because, Mark, uh, Matt, why don't you pull any one down here, just pull that white one out here, because they take up less space. You have a two and a half inch post instead of a four and a half or a five inch post. You had a, a you know a lightweight rail, but again, very strong. And of course, the, the spacing is going to be for uh, childproof rail code compliance, which would be less than four inches. So it's, uh, and it's of course very strong. A very good uh, use for these rails is if people come in and they won't have any rails on their deck. Okay. They, they work fine, but when you really sell a lot of it is when people come in and they have these masonry front steps or stoops. Okay. Some of them can be eight feet high and nine steps, and there isn't any railings on it at all because usually masons don't think about putting railings on it. But when people come in and they'll say that their homeowner's insurance, they came in did an inspection of the house, they said they have to have rails on this thing by in two weeks or they're going to be canceled. So these work really well because you just... You just screw this in. Matt, pull that, uh, that rail tree over here. That, uh, oh, look at this, a classic rail okay. tree. I yes. mean, look at this. Okay, so in this one here, if we take off the skirt, and that's why we've got this one here, is that these four bolts will go, you can drill your hole any way you want, whether you use a hammer drill and use the lead shields like we did in the old days, or they got those blue ones, and there's all different kinds. But however you feel is going to work the best for you, because that's up to the carpenter to do that. They're not going to tell you how to do that one. Okay. Works great, and it cuts the price down, because this one, we call this, for lack of a better word, a flush mount post. And we do sell those that would go onto that same masonry, and then you'd slide over your composite sleeves. Okay. But with the, uh, with the aluminum rails, that part comes already with it. So... That is a All definite there. price advantage on that. So we have three different brands we're going to look at today. Let's take we're a look We're going to look here. at a Trex Signature Rail, which is their aluminum rail. The Azac or TimberTech, their Impressions Rail. Okay. And we have, uh, if, we've done some stuff from these guys years and years ago. Uh, Key Link Railing. Sounds new to the, uh, well, to yeah, the network the, well, here. It's, uh, they have an aluminum rail. Okay. With the standard balusters. So why don't we just start with that one? Let's Bring do it. Let's right dive right, right in. One right okay. here. We got three different, and they have a bunch of different colors. These guys down in Pennsylvania, Amos and uh, Abraham, they do a great job. They really think about making things that people are going to want. Look at all the different colors. There's, there's so many. Of that would be a special order. And uh, but this stuff is in the the white or the black and white probably in the. 40 42 dollar a linear foot range all of them cost about the same a little high up or a little lower okay but uh, this rail it comes in many many colors and we get different styles this gloss is, white yeah, the, 90 bronze yeah, the arabian and this is the american and uh let's pull these out now okay what this yeah, rail good, Mike. Yeah, i mean yeah, yeah it's a great rail but what well, the reason why i wanted to bring this up is because the next show is going to be on cable rails Ooh. and my friends at keylink have got cable rails dialed in. So look for that show. That's why they'll be, we'll, they'll be up on the next show. So Coming to an internet near you. Yes. So this one here is the Trex Signature aluminum rail. On a piece of spiced rum, yeah. it looks like. Right. Tiki torch. Ooh, close. Oh. Yeah. Ah. And um, it was called the Reveal Rail for the first few years, but this one is part of a broad term product launch and they rebranded it changed the name a little bit but it's got some lights this one is the that's the two and a half inch posts and it, this one is the crossover post they come in a number of different ways for whatever configuration that you'd like to do if you want to have a continuous handrail like by some codes that it is that on stairs you can do it with this rail there or you can use the ada rail this is the reveal or the, the uh, signature in black this is the new post cap light that just came out Nice. People were asking for something like that. Really nice. They and it's delivered. got this other little rail light on here. That's really sharp. The lights, these are a little, they're, they're kind of pricey. These are about $75 for that one there. And they think these are the same as a regular accent light or a rail light would be. And that's about $47. Okay. Great rail. Comes in the, <clears throat> the three colors. They have their, their bronze, which is a very 
usable bronze, a very normal bronze. They're white and, of course, the black. Very neutral and, uh, colors. We stock the black ones here at No Maintenance Decks. In Most Farmingdale. people buy the square balusters or um, just about every single one. I think just the way the configuration of the rail is, it doesn't really work well with a round, whereas the composite rails, round balusters, look great on it. Okay, so let's get the... Okay, but before we finish that trek, that was Trex. Let's pull the tree back out here. Let's do it. Because this is uh, made by the Trex company. All different options. You really nice here. looking thing. This I has mean, got a lot of cool stuff. Uh, you're going to have fixed... You could have a fixed rail, like it is on that signature rail. Fixed, okay. horizontal, a fixed stair, normal. But a lot of times these things just aren't normal. And we always know that. This one you could put if you want a continuous handrail going down the stairs. This one is a... If you had a, an angle that's not 45 not and not 90, you can do it this, top and bottom. This was a stair one, pretty much is a hinge stair bracket. <coughs> this was a real nice one here. So if you're going down stairs and you've had a couple an of cocktails already, so this so one is, a, down. is more of a compound angle. It goes right. left and right and up and down. All, all different. That's what you're looking uses. for, boy. They come up with it. Trex has got a lot of great engineers working on this stuff day and night down there in Winchester, Virginia. Now, the last one is grab that last one over here. This one is the. Let's uh, go to some of these. That's the. Uh, uh, this is the Impressions Rail by Azac Timber Tech. Looks good. It's got a little more detail. So it's going to cost a little more. These are in the $42, $43 a linear foot. But that's still not bad because it costs less than the composite rails. Nice. Got a little more detail. It's a ni nice job they did on these rails. Instead of a square baluster, it's more of a rectangular baluster. And someday someone asked me if this gets hot when it's in the summertime. And because if it's an aluminum rail, it's going to conduct its heat throughout the whole rail. So when you put your hand on these one, it's 95 degrees. It's really not super hot. So that's a that's a plus for that's that one. That's a very good upside yeah, too. Yeah. So that one, um, that one was the one they call that one their bronze color. It's almost like a light black. Yeah, I was gonna say almost had a gray. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's uh, for the most part their black one is the one that we sell the most of. But they do have a bronze. Maybe one of these days they're gonna come out with a white also. But as we know from selling. Uh, aluminum rails for a while people want the black is always going to be the biggest seller yeah and uh, we stock them we stock them we here? stock we stock the the tr the uh, trek signature and the timber tech or and azac impressions okay so anything else i'm sure we're going to have here pretty we, promptly, but that's I mean. the, but that's what most of the sales are on that when we sell them all we'll the take time. care of you okay that is it for today's show this is a nice quick one about but it's, rails but, very good aluminum rails and Stay tuned for the cable rail show because that's, that's going to integrate the aluminum rails. Going to put it all together, yeah. one nice bow. Okay, that's it for today's show. If you have any questions or comments, you can direct them to Matt at the deck network .com. or Mike at the deck network .com. Thank the, you so uh, much for watching. The, the letters are coming in, the emails are coming in. Click, like, share, follow us, do all that fun stuff. That's it for today's show. Thanks we'll see, for watching. We'll see you later. Have a great day. Ciao for now.